Today on Live at 4, the man at the center of a manhunt in Waukesha County could now face more than 43 years in prison. Jonathan Pogriba was arrested in the Waukesha County Courthouse yesterday. Today, the 43-year-old Town of Eagle resident was back in court. Lauren Winfrey was there and has new details on this case. This has been a case that we have been monitoring for a while, so we want to take it out to Lauren. And what have you learned so far about today's developments? Yeah, Katie and Charles, well, Pogriba didn't say much while he was in the courtroom. His mom was actually there and she was sitting behind me and she was in tears. Uh, we do know that two additional charges have been added. That's now six total, which is has increased the penalties assigned to him. And they do believe he is a flight risk. So that's why the court has set his bail at $150 in cash. Court will call state of Wisconsin versus Jonathan Pogriba. Dressed in a red jumpsuit and shackled at his hands and feet, Jonathan Pogriba appeared in court for the first time since his arrest. He was jailed in Waukesha County overnight Thursday for a felony warrant with a $100,000 cash bail. At the time the warrant was issued, in that amount, uh, there were only four counts. There have since been uh, two additional serious felonies that have been added to this criminal complaint. Those two felonies include burglary and theft, and the amended criminal complaint says Pogriba broke into a neighbor's home with intent to steal and did intentionally take and drive a vehicle without consent of the owner. But his attorney, Donna Kukler, says Pogriba wasn't aware of the initial outstanding warrant. No one served him with a warrant. He didn't have actual notice of a warrant until a certain point in time. When he became aware of the warrant and he got a hold of us, we made arrangements to get him here. Pogriba led law enforcement on a manhunt earlier in the month after a domestic incident involving his wife and son. He's accused of threatening his wife with a gun and slamming her head into a garage door. And court documents indicate the note Pogriba left behind while on the run for weeks reads, I am evil and hoping soon you all forget about me. Mr. Pogrebo was in fugitive status for a number of days. I am aware that he turned himself in, uh, but Mr. Pogrebo did decide to run. And just to reiterate, that cash bail is set at $150,000, but this isn't Pogrebo's first run in with the law. He was charged with disorderly conduct uh, a few years ago, and he is due back in court next week. Reporting live outside the Waukesha County Courthouse, Lord Winfrey, today's TMJ4. All right, Lauren, thanks.